What's going on guys, welcome back to another awesome episode where we're going to be checking out the third wave of the Hot Wheels Boulevard cars. These are the new Hot Wheels Premium range. And uh, yeah, we'll just start by checking out the card art as usual. And as always, they're, they're doing some pretty good card art these days. A quick look at the car, the Tri 5 by Fire, the uh, Hoonigan car. And have a quick look at the back, a quick look at the assortment that we get and all the rest of the legal mumbo jumbo you can pause and read if you wish. So there we go, there's the gasser. Next we'll just check out the card art of the Garage of Legends Pontiac GTO. Very nice with a red and metallic grey. Nice. Number three is the Vaughan Gittin Jr. Ford GT. And it's very cool. Uh, kind of plain in the way of tampos, but we'll keep moving along quickly. And this we have the uh, Volkswagen Baja Bug. Uh, actually, that one's very cool. I do quite like the rainbow paint job on that. And the last car in the set is the 91 Mercedes-Benz G-Class. Very nice. Very nicely detailed, this one. So anyway, let's get these all out of the way and crack on with the 55 Chevy Bel Air Gasser. And this one's already trying to escape the package. That makes that very handy. Very cool. Here you have it in a grey primer colour. And you have a metallic or a chrome black engine and grill. And there is a variation of a plain black with no uh, tint, chrome tint to it. So uh, we'll just have a quick look. And as you can see on the one in the back here, there is no actual chrome tint to the engine. It is just a plain black engine with a plain black interior. Whereas you can see the interior in this it has that chrome effect. Uh, this one is just completely blacked out. So be on the lookout for the variation of the Chevy Bel Air Gasser. Let's get back into this. All right. There are some awesome drag racing style wheels, try 5 by fire on the side. You have your front headlight details, very cool. You've got your little gas tank there. And once again, you have that black chrome engine and interior. On the side, we have some Hoonigan stickers, a Summit sticker, a little uh, face, I think. I can't quite see what that is just there. And we also have some just down the bottom there too. Big Huesiers on the back, skinny little tyres on the front. That's the base there. Something on the base. And on the back we have the big Hoonigan sticker on the window. And 150, is that VHY? I think so. And there we go, number one. Very, very cool. Number two in the set. The Pontiac GTO, which is, to be honest, this is my personal favourite out of the entire pack. I really, really like this. And we'll just crack this open. And I'll show you exactly why I like this. As you can see, it's a really nice dark metallic grey with some extra red. And then you have your two-tone red on the side there. We also have these new wheels. And... Uh, some writing all on the side, GTO on the side there. It's just such a cool looking lowrider. Really nice details on the back. HW GTO on the license plate. Really nice lights. That is so cool. Such an awesome looking design. But what I wanted to show you was they're kind of keeping a theme going with some of these classic cars. This is out of a previous Hot Wheels Boulevard series. Uh, wave 1, I do believe it was. So yeah, even though this has a lighter silver, still nice to have a silver and red combination. Number 3 in the set is the Ford GT. This is the Vaughan Gittin Jr. And it's very exciting to open this one up because uh, looking through the packaging, it didn't really have that much detail, so I wanted to actually see what it 
actually had. And on the front, all you get is the headlight details, a Ford logo, a little bit of paint on the venting just there, which is actually that's actually a pretty nice touch. I'm glad that they did that. Uh, metal base, metal bodies, obviously. Uh, you have a little yellow spot on the wheel. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what this is, but there you go. Uh, on the back, we have some rear light details, some exhaust details too, so I'm very happy for that. And you can see into the engine there. Grey interior. Very simple, but still a very nice looking car. Number four is the most colourful car in the pack, the Volkswagen Baja Bug. This one's actually really cool. I do quite like this one with the big off-road wheels. You have some headlight details, indicator lights, big huge white wheels, and this rainbow pattern which goes around the whole thing, which is very cool. It's a very 70s design on a 70s designed car. Big exhaust out the back with the air-cooled engine. Just absolutely cool. What a cool looking car. You can see the part of the engine down the bottom there. All the support there. That's just cool. That's a really cool looking car. And it's actually a um, metallic pearl colour. It's got a kind of like a yellow tinge to the, uh, the paint there. I don't know if you can see that, but that's really cool. And the final car in the set is the 91 Mercedes-Benz G-Class. Let's see what this looks like. Wow, this is actually very, very light. It's a, it's a lot lighter than these two cars. These two actually have quite a substantial amount of weight to them. This one here is just a metallic silver. A little bit of black striping along the side there. Some grey off-road wheels. Mercedes-Benz logo headlight details on the front there. A little bit of grille detail too. And on the back we have Mercedes-Benz on the spare tyre cover. Some brake lights, reverse lights. And that's about all. Can we remove this? Awesome! There we go. Well, that can just go out of the screen for a while. We don't need to see that. How cool is that? And here we have an open top off-roading monster. Very cool. Go off-road in style. And there we go. Hope you all enjoyed. I will put... Uh, no, it's not really going to work. I won't worry about that. You all got to see that there is a black interior and engine variation. Be sure to keep your eyes open for that. Please leave all your comments below. I always love to hear what you think about these sets. Uh, be sure to check out my other playlist for other random videos. Uh, yeah. Until next time, hope you all have a great day, and I'll see you all then. Bye.